find, move, or delete duplicate files in three simple steps. Start by opening Easy Duplicate Finder. When you open the application, you will be presented with Easy Duplicate Finder Register Now button. If you haven't already registered, you can do it now so you don't have to do it later. Next, you will see the EDF Tech Tips. When you're ready, click Get Started. You can either drag and drop your folders into the blue box or click Add Folder. Select your folders and you will see them appear. You can select the file type you want to search for. I have chosen to select all. And finally, you can narrow your search by file size. I recommend unchecking these. Then click Start Scan. see a summary of duplicates in your scanned folders. Move to step 3 and fix them. Use this clever filtering system to further narrow your searches if you'd like. To resolve the duplicates, you can manually select files individually. You can use the assistant to retain the newest, oldest, or original files, or you can also do this by using the duplicates dropdown. For this example, I've chosen to keep the oldest of the duplicates. Once you have files selected, you can choose to rename these files, move them to a different folder, or delete them entirely. I've chosen to move them to a different folder. If I want to delete them at a later date, I can easily do that. The folder is called Moved Files, then click Get Started. Please note, if you have a lot of files, and if they are large, these may take a little time. Just be patient and wait for the program to complete its task. All the duplicates that have been resolved will now be highlighted to show which ones have been processed and which ones remain unchanged. The duplicate files have been moved to the new folder and the job is done. If you realize that you have removed or deleted the wrong files, you can undo and retrieve, as long as it's within the same session.